Hey everybody, happy Friday. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. Today's video is going to be a very, very quick, uh, I guess you could say review of this wig that I have on here. This, if you are not familiar with it, is the Bobbi Boss Xenon wig. It's very, very similar to their Yara wig, but it's really just a lot shorter. So I literally had to go on a mission to find this wig. This wig was literally sold out everywhere, which I expected because it was really, I was starting to see a lot of videos here on YouTube, so I figured that a lot of people were gonna want to try it out and I couldn't find it anywhere. I'll put the link to the place that I was able to find this wig at and the color and all the information about the wig there below. So I wanna talk really quick just about it. Um, this is pretty much, like it's almost fresh out the box. So I ha I've worn this wig about six times now. Um, and I did it is it does take heat so I did straighten just the ends a little bit but I didn't do much to the part um, all I really did was kind of take it down onto uh, let's adjust that there onto my forehead to make it look a little realistic and I didn't have to pluck the hairs or anything like that it comes with two combs in the front one comb in the back and at first I definitely was gonna say that it wasn't big head friendly or it wasn't like thick girl thick hair girl thick girl thick haired girl friendly if you have curly hair that's thick um, but today when I put it on I actually do have a little bit more room and it could have a stretched or it could have just been the way that I was pinning down my hair um, but it is all the way now in the back here which it never did before and I just have my hair picked up here underneath and it's a uh, pretty pretty comfortable I would say so if you have a bigger head or you have thick hair this wig definitely works for you it definitely helps um, space but if you have a smaller head or you know somewhere in the middle it does have straps and combs for you to adjust the wig if need be um i would say that i got a good amount of shedding but i think that's because from the day i got it i've been playing around with styles i'm really just trying to see if i could wear it differently um i did flip it in one of my videos over i mean one of my photos over this way um i gave like a side kind of bob feel i really at first when i got this I really wanted this wig to be um, a side part. I love, 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 love side parts. I rarely wear a middle part. Um, but I'm actually, this is growing on me. I don't know if it's because of the cut and the color, but I am starting to like this middle part. So I've kind of given up a little on trying to make it a side part. I think I'm just gonna rock it to the middle. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Not shedding normal, it's a synthetic wig. I, I guess I would say I got this for around 40 bucks. Um, give or take a little bit. I don't really remember what the shipping was, so very much um, affordable. And I'm actually really excited to see how it's going to hold up. Like I said, I've worn it about six or seven times, and I really haven't had any issues other than shedding. But we'll see as it goes along. Let me know what you think about this wig in the comments below. If you get it in this color or any other color, and if you've tried out Bobby Boss's hair before, I'm actually very, 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 very much in love with their products. Um, if you don't know, I did have faux locks and it was by the same brand and that's how I was introduced to the brand and from there it's been nothing but bliss. So I'm really excited to uh, find more things from this company and maybe one day in the future I will be able to work with them. But enough of me yapping. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you next Tuesday in my next one.